I went to the farmer's market today and look how big this beet is. Beets gets a bad rap, but it's freaking amazing if you give it a chance and cook it right, which I'm about to show At you. At the grocery store, it cost like four to five dollars for like three smaller version of these. I spent three dollars for three huge ones. And then look at the beautiful Brussels. So these are a great combo. If you're a runner, you definitely need to be adding beets into your diet. It's really good for blood flow. It's really good for athletes in general, good for your heart. And it may get you going if you've been struggling with regularity. How gorgeous they are. You have to be careful that you cut away from you because they do leak red. Kind of like a pomegranate, you have to be careful with the juices. But once you peel the skin off, you rinse it, and then you cut it in cubes. You can drizzle olive oil if you want to. I like to be oil free as much as possible. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees. Cut up some Brussels, or you don't have to do Brussels. I just like cooking them together. It tastes amazing. And sprinkle your favorite seasoning. But yeah, you can, uh, I sprayed the pan with Pam. You can do, I ran out of foil, so this is what, what I'm working with. But you can do, I guess, everything with the bagel. Everyone loves that, but I don't have a Trader Joe's yet. Um, roasted garlic herb from Grill Mates is I love the using bomb. this um, organic, gluten-free, non-GMO, all the things, coconut minos, and just sprinkle it. And you can also do balsamic, but I don't have any. But balsamic is really good too. And then what do you do? You zhuzh it? Is that what you say? Zhuzh it? It's kind of hard to do it with my phone. 400 degrees and um, about 30 minutes, but we'll check it to see if it's, you know, done at 30 minutes. It may need to cook longer. So I ended up just doing it for 40 minutes and then lightly broiling it for a few minutes. So, oh my gosh, you guys. Oh my gosh. It's caramelized. It's going to be so good. Trying to do this in better lighting. Um, yeah. Good, right? And I used those zero-carb noodles, the shiitake noodles that you can find by the tofu section. And then this is pre-toss. <laughs> so good.